spinach. <laughs> Another thing is oranges. That's I'd about. <laughs> About six thank you, Norman. Thank you. You've done a fabulous job. I'll tell you job. another thank time you. about Norman, the oranges. Excellent, exquisite. Um, Richard, thanks for coming on. I mean, just take your time. You know, I <laughs> God forbid. I what, what took you so long? Uh, no, I wasn't doing your hair. No, I know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, Dicky, you think you, you think you're ready to do an interview? You just want to cash out here? I'm yes. Just... No, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, thanks. Uh, could everybody please welcome the Godfather of the Rocky Horror Show, Count? Yeah, Richard O'Brien. <laughs> So, uh, Dick. Ruby. Dick, tell us how did it start? I mean, just, you know, how, how'd you start a cult? Uh, it started itself, actually. Yeah. Yeah. These things do, you know. You can't, you can't, you can't predict these things. But, I mean, did you expect people to suddenly dress up like you, or did you no, plan this out? No, no, we expected our show to run for five weeks and have a happy five weeks. Right. That's all. So, are you surprised that people suddenly show up? Well, would you? wouldn't you be? <laughs> would certainly. If I looked like you, I would be. <laughs> anyway, just tell me, like the conventions, what goes on there? Well, people do dress up, but I think it's I think it's right that they do dress up. It's better that they're dressed than undressed. Isn't What's it? the look? Tell everybody who doesn't know. I don't know why. Well, people come along dressed as the characters, and um, you know, they uh, get into fishnets on the street and whatnot. You know, that yeah. sort of thing. So men suddenly put on the old girdle and <laughs> hit the road? Well, it's good, it's good fun, really. It's, it's really good theatre. I saw it once in, in a place in Long Island, and they had 2,000 people singing the, the songs along with the, with the show. They had the characters dressed up doing the show on stage. And it was just a marvellous bit of theatre. You couldn't, you couldn't actually create that theatre because you couldn't get 2,000 people together at one time, but they do it themselves. It's, it's wonderful, actually. And you get richer from it, don't you? Um, you don't decide everything. A lot, a lot of money. A lot I, of money. Is. Beyond your wildest dreams, Ruby. Yeah. But is it, is it like, do people see you? Yeah, I know. I know. I mean, look at me. That salad. That's my props. Um, just do, do people, like, do people worship you, you know, when you go to those conventions? What kind of people are, are into, you know, like suddenly saying, well, I want to be Richard O'Brien? I think anybody that that anyone that's obsessed enough to become part of a cult, it's a strange sort of thing. However, there is a sort of family thing that goes on. They make friends there and do all that sort of thing. I mean, there's so is it loneliness that makes people do this? I think, I think a lot of it is, is wanting to be in show business. I think everybody wants to be in show business, right. and it's a chance to dress up and be in show business. I think that's a very essential point. Yeah. Mm. Wait, just a minute. Sorry. Mm. Sorry, we're on to the next guest. Okay. Sorry, Richard, if you come in late, you got to leave early. I'm okay. sorry, we got a lot of traffic on this show. We stop for no man's okay. ego. All right? Okay. So, hey, Spike, what's your obsession? Thanks, uh, Richard. Okay, see you. Stay in the <laughs> And bank managers. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Together loan from my bank manager this morning. Yeah. He said, don't be a fool. Put that gun down. <laughs> <laughs> and so what happened? Nothing. That's the end of the joke. All right. Um, <laughs> next question, please. Yes. Uh, I left the bath running. Hurry up. What, what about trumpet playing? I'll tell you what you did. You played trumpet, Yeah, I, I, I'm obsessional about jazz. So I was obsessional about jazz and I played trumpet. <laughs> Thank you.